tomorrow. And this morning, we're giving you an inside look at how it all comes together. That's right. Our Sam Carter is live at the Galt House. He is inside the command center at Thunder Over Louisville. But Sam, don't press that big button. That's for the Thundernator. Right. <laughs> You mean that big button that they have a big old sign? I'm gonna touch it though. Just a, just a, uh, just a quick little thing, guys. On my left hand side here, I have the nerve center inside the nerve center. Two men with perhaps the coolest titles on the planet Earth. It is Matt and Mike. They are the air bosses. Matt, I want to start with you very quickly. What is an air boss? Other than a cool title. Uh, well, it is a cool title. No, the air boss is the person who is uh, ultimately responsible for ensuring uh, safety and the execution of the air show as, uh, as we've submitted our plan to the, uh, to the FAA. So awesome. we, have, we have to, everything within about five miles of, uh, of show center that operates, if it breaks ground, be it a drone, be it an airplane, be it anything, uh, we have to talk to them. They have to have permission. And, uh, we control the entire area. Yeah, an important thing to actually to point out is you're not allowed to bring your personal drone. So yes. don't do that. And Mike, you know, there's a huge radius around the river that people aren't allowed to come to. You guys are kind of in charge of monitoring that, right? It's called a TFR, temporary flight restriction. And within five miles of show center, you don't fly without talking to Matt or me. That was such a great answer, man. They're, <laughs> they're probably the two most important guys in Louisville tomorrow at three o'clock. But guys, I really want to reintroduce you to somebody that I think is the coolest guy ever. <laughs> His name is Wayne and he is the reason all of this exists, or at least a large part of My the reason. Pappy for the week, so yeah. Awesome. Can I call you Pappy? Oh, absolutely. That's the coolest thing ever. Uh, Wayne, for those who don't know, you are one of the creators of right. Thunder. What's it like? You're 35. Talk to me about your emotions years. going into I'm this. a little older than 35, but the show <laughs> itself is 35. I don't even know how to put it into words, Sam. I mean, I, it's been a ride that... No, if everybody could have the opportunity and the fun I've had for 35 years, uh, I wish it, uh, I wish everybody could do that because it has been fantastic. There's a balcony right behind you. Right. Do you ever stand out on that balcony and just look down and see the hundreds of thousands of people that have turned out for an event that you helped put together? Yeah, it kind of swells up my chest a bit, for sure. <laughs> yeah, it, it's great, particularly when, when Mother Nature works with us. And Which sounds like it will thing. tomorrow. And we're, so we're looking at hopefully a record crowd. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited already. Fingers crossed for you on that Thank one. You. Pappy. Now, Pappy, I'm told I'm not allowed to touch the button, but no, that's, we're going to, yeah. I'm going to touch the button. We knew you were coming. <laughs> Pappy, <laughs> you know me all too well. I really want to turn the keys and touch the button, but that would spoil it, guys. Three o'clock tomorrow. That is when the air show begins. I've never been to Thunder, but from what I'm gathering, you want to get downtown way quick, way earlier than 3 o'clock if you want to get a good spot to watch it. There's going to be a C-130 popping flares, apparently, at 1,000 feet. I got to see this. Show. Yes, yes, <laughs> Guys, we're going to be back after CBS Mornings with a whole lot more from the command center. Cannot wait to show you everything. Wait, Welcome you're aboard, electric, Sam. my guy. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Wayne's electric. I love this guy. Oh, I love it. Sam's a kid in a candy shop this morning. Yep. Just don't touch.